Welcome back to Friday Night Frenzy. Back to the hardwood we go. Greenfield on the road trying to knock off unbeaten Hopkins Academy. The green wave on the road. It's Cody West in the paint. Takes it. Fade away is good. Gets another shot to fall here. Nice slick move out of number two. That's not all we would see out of him tonight, though. Big stuff to come. Patrick Fitzgibbons in traffic. Not a problem. Now the green waves turn right back and forth in this one. Rebound by Daniel Pena. Sets a little screen for Cam Mur Caleb Murray. He gets the triple. And then it's Caleb Thomas from way downtown with the range. Yeah, he knows it. Strong celebration there. He's going to take it. He can't just shoot it from far out. He's also going to show his body control to the hole. Now it's Teddy Sir for Hopkins to James Fitzgibbons. And this one, an all-time finish tonight. We couldn't hang around for the ending, but down two seconds left. Cody West baked in a game-winning three for the 77-76 win. Unreal scene. Hopkins stays unbeated. Chickabee Comp now looking to knock off unbeated Pope Francis on the road tonight. Comp took an early lead. Adriana Correa Barley with the triple. And then it's Taryn Caravo to Mariah Rodriguez. Yes, same spot, same result. Maeve Termal now says, I'm going to take it myself all the way to the bucket. Left hand dribble, right hand drive, and the foul. Then Ava Albano making it rain from up top after a nice little finish here on the baseline. One more Termal Albano connection. Comp led at halftime. Close one in the fourth. A Jade Marsh in the paint and the foul. Then it's the Pope defense. Isabella Meadows picks a pocket, not once, but twice. This time, she goes coast to coast to give the Cardinals the double figure lead. They stay unbeaten and win it 60 to 49. Also on the girls' side of things, special shout out to Springfield International Charter School girls basketball player, Alicia Mitchell. On Tuesday night, the junior recorded her 1,000th career point in a 72-39 win over Mount Greylock. She finished the game with 37 points. That set a single game school record. And she beats, guess who? Mitchell herself. She had the previous record with 36. She's also closing in on 1,000 rebounds, and she's only a junior. Congratulations, Alicia.